What's up, everybody? It's your boy, American Idiot Fan 2019 Productions, here with a another video. I'm playing a game on Roblox called Circuit de Catalonia by Karam Karamiko12. Correct me if I pronounce that wrong. So there's a good batch of cars on here, and some that aren't too great too. What's this ra randomly? What's this mysterious car? It appears to be a Mercedes. Well, let me look at the back. A Mercedes AMG six I mean, C63 S. There's no engine sound. That's nice. Eh, it doesn't really bother me. Oh. This car doesn't drive too good. It's a bit on the loose side. So, Karamiko, if you're watching this, can you please um fix that car's handling to have a bit of a tighter handling system? Thanks. I've never driven this one, the Orica. Manor Racing. Okay. I stand corrected. I've seen this car a few hundred times before. But I'll just give it try drive it because eh, sure why not. And later in this video we'll get to one of my absolute favorite cars in this game. This car needs to go like needs to have a a lower final like a very low final drive so that it goes goes faster. Like it has a higher top speed if you know what I mean. Oh I wasn't paying enough attention to realize that my car went went into the wall. Yeet. Aw, uh, yeet. 150 miles an hour. Wonder if I could just top out at this corner. Yeet. I like the car, but it's just a bit like the top speed is a bit too low. Like, it should be at least, like, 190-something. Okay, I wonder if this is the same car. Yep, it is. Uh, here. Uh. Yeah! I love that. It just has the roar of a lion. This thing goes fast. Oh my god. Whoever created this car pays a lot of attention to detail. <laughs> the brakes are awesome. I love the handling of this thing.
Let's see how fast this thing goes. Ow. I can say that it does go over 300 miles an hour. Way faster than a Bugatti. Alright. My phone's running on low, so... I should probably... Only do like a couple more cars. One of the things I like about this car, which is the 2018, yep, Ford Mustang GT. Oh wait, rock. I think this, that's the wrong car. I swear there was a Ford. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna go back a few steps. Uh, where is it? It's a Shelby. Shelby underscore K3000. One thing I like about this car is that you can actually, unlike mo a lot of the cars in Roblox, you can actually change the color of it. Ooh, I like that color. I'm going to change it to red. Oh uh, yeah. Just listen to that lion roar. Ow. The turning isn't too great on it though, or either that or it's the braking. Come on, I haven't driven this Chevrolet Chevelle SS yet. This is one of them cars that has uh, that you can't even drive. I'm trying. There we go. You can't even drive this car. How about it? Uh, let's check out this Chevelle SS instead. Oh, I like it. It only goes 112 miles an hour. What's the what's the deal with that? And I'm gonna tell you right now, this is my favorite car in the game. Well, that happened. Let me try that again. Oh my God! Can I please stop deleting that vehicle? It's impossible. Oh my god. I feel like my controller is trolling me. Okay. Once my car goes, go. I'll follow my car down this hill. I didn't pick a good place to spawn it. Hold on. Here, I'll show you why it's my favorite car. Because the user, whoever made this car, just pays so much attention to detail. You can look at the engine. It's not realistic, but it's the start. I, I look, you can look under the hood. You can open the car door. You can do this. You can even look right here, where all the license plates and, and other stuff is. All I want to say to the person or people who made this car, God bless you. Like, another reason I love this car is because it drives great.
That is the most realistic sounding Camaro I have ever seen for a Roblox game, I, will, I might add. This 1990 Camaro IROC Z just in general blows me away. Great braking, just really, really, just real, very realistic for a Roblox game. God bless you, creator of this car. Slash creators, or if if multiple people were behind this cre this godful creation. Godly creation, I I mean. And that blue paint job, though, it is just so natural. I've never driven this turn before. You know what? Just because I love it so much, I'm gonna I'm gonna drive, do another another go around go with around with this. I am just so pleased, like with whoever made this car. I I am so thankful for this car. This is just one of the Ow. I'm going to take this corner this time. I'm playing with a USB and it's getting really, really annoying. You can't believe how much I need batteries right now. I eat, like, it's beyond words, basically. I you just don't know. Okay, for real. I'm gonna just let this, let this go. Two hundred three miles an hour. That's really fast. Let me show you the first car I ever drove when I booted up the scheme earlier. What the? Ooh, that that is so loud. I need to turn it. I have to turn my headset down. And I finally learned how to drive a manual transmission. You got to shift is RT and Y. I mean RB and Y. RT is to accelerate. I'm gonna stick stick it with. I'm gonna stick with ST, whatever that stands for.
It accelerates a bit too fast, though. I'm just gonna make it a bit, like, accelerate a bit more realistically. I just lightly tap the, the gas. I'll show you how to do it. Hold on. Uh, so what you do is you push it down as lightly, and when it goes, like, okay, just go on a, just find a straightaway. Like, uh, find a straightaway with no hill, or, like, it's just perfectly straight. Like, right here. And just type it, tap it, as, make it to make it go as lightly as you want to go, and press start, and press it again, and your car will stay, will go that speed. I love this car so much. There's a bit, a little bit too much braking. There's some cars where like, kind of like the porridge is too hot, or the braking is a bit, there's a bit too much braking, the porridge is too cold, the po like, the braking, like, there's not enough braking. And it's just right. The brakes are like the car drives and brakes perfectly. But other than that, this car is pretty awesome. It's a Mustang Fastback, one of my favorite, like a first generation Mustang Fastback, which is my favorite Mustang in the series. So that's all I'm gonna do with this game. If you wanna check it out and play it for yourself the link will be in the description below if I can find it um, if you can't find it look up Circuit de Catalunya and you should come across this game which is classic and if you want to see more Roblox racing game content please make sure to give this video a thumbs up comment down below and like what Roblox games you want to see me play and subscribe for more content like this if you're new to the channel, of course. This is American Idiot Fan 2019 Productions. Over and out. Peace.